But yeah. I, I don't know. That's that's just pretty much the situation. You, you fucking get what I'm saying. Obviously, nobody wants to put out content if nobody's gonna watch it. But at the same time, you know, you want to do what you want to do. Because that's what you enjoy doing. Like, if I sat here and posted a bunch of shit, but I didn't enjoy it. Like, what what's the point of doing that, you know? Like, all that would be is doing YouTube as a job. And it's not even a consistent job at that. Because, like... Say I got views, you know, say I got a shit ton of views for two months, right? And I made some money. And then all of a sudden, my channel started to die. Then all of a sudden, it's like, you know, I, I had a raise and then I fucking lost the raise or something. Like, YouTube isn't a consistent, like, you know, it's not like a guaranteed source of income. Whereas, if I had an actual job and I just did the same shit every day... You know, at least my money's guaranteed with that. You know, you don't have no 401ks and shit with YouTube. If you guys even know what that is. But, like, it's just... It's the fact of... It, it would become a job, and it's not even a satisfying one at that. With no guarantee as to, you know, whether I'd even be able to do it or not like that. Which is why, in my streams, like, you know, I post what I usually post. And then in my streams, I just kind of stream whatever I want. Because, like... Obviously, I could probably get, you know, double the amount of viewers if I played something else. But it's just like, I just want to play what I want to play. You know, I just want to do me and stream, just chill. And then have whatever I post on the channel. And that's that's kind of the, the way I've built my channel. Like, I'm sure there are things I could have done to get more views. But at the same time, like, like Burning Blood. I gained a lot of subscribers from people that wanted to see Burning Blood content. Like, I got, like, one of my videos has, I think, like, 3,000 views on it now. It's just a random burning blood video, but like a lot of them I was looking back at my old videos and seeing like how much of them have gained traction without me even realizing it and it's just like You know like I gained a decent amount of subscribers on it, and then I just stopped playing it and it's like I, I probably lost out on you know a certain amount of views and it's like if I would have kept posting it But it's like I got tired of it. I couldn't get any other DLC because it's in Jip, you know, it's on a Japanese account that shit was taking forever to release in English, and I, I honestly, I, there wasn't anything worth paying, you know, an extra $60 for. Some people might have wanted to see player matches or something, but it's just like, it, it's not worth it to me. I don't make fucking money like that to where I can just keep buying $60 games just because people want to see an online match. I still did every single character in the game, like, you know, tons of content on it, and it's just like... Uh, they, you know, it's like I can only do so much it's Especially with like, you know, it's I don't know. It's just like I just stopped posting it though Basically some people probably unsub some people might just be inactive, but at the same time You know, I posted what I wanted and I may not grow as fast as other people or I might not have a specific you know fan base, but well, I would, I would technically have a specific... For some reason, when I thought that said puppet, I was thinking that it was, like, gonna turn me into an invisible thing or put down the dollars. I, I don't... I'm not actually sure. Fucking back up off me, bot. Uh, is anyone even in that one? That thing is just coming at me with, like, nobody in it. That's kinda wild. How do I shoot again? Hey. But it's just, like, I just kinda switch it up. I post whatever, and... You know, if you don't like that, obviously they're not going to watch it. But if I do manage to build a fan base off of posting whatever I want, then, you know, I get what I wanted. I get people that watch me for who I am, and I enjoy what I post. So, you know, that's the main idea behind it. But it's it's kind of hard to tell because, like, even, like, my Heat the Soul stuff, right? The first episode, obviously I was smaller at the time. This was probably around when I had, like, 300 or 400 subs. But when I posted it, I got like 200 views or 198 views on the first part on the first day. And only having like 400 subs or whatever I had, that's insanely well. That's amazing ratios, you know? But then the second time I posted it, I got like half the views or something. It just didn't do as well, you know? And I don't know if that's because people... Nobody said anything though, you know? Like, nobody said, oh, I dislike this or... You know, they didn't interest them. Because I had some people that said they wanted to see more, but, like, the views showed otherwise, you know? And, like, I would love to post stuff that, you know, other people would want to see and that I would want to, you know, do. But, like, at the same time, it's it's a waste of time, basically, if nobody wants to watch it, you know? So, it, it's just kind of, like, it, it all depends. I can jump in this thing? That's kind of wild. 
That's actually wild. I just realized I have like little, I don't have actual feet. I have like hover feet. Then again, I can't see a boy. If I was torn up right now, you could have seen all kinds of ass. I wish these things had like a super or something, like some type of super bomb or super explosion, some type of mechanism that just lets you hit them with the bang. You feel me? Pow! But it's, eh, I don't know. Like, I, I, I'm the type of person that likes quality. Like, I bought a fucking boom arm and all this shit for my mic. Uh, you know, I constantly increase my setup, which, it, it, you know, the way I see it is I'm just kind of putting money into a hobby, not expecting anything back from it. And like, that, that was the mindset I had. It's more due to the fact that, obviously, I create better content. And that that's more so just because I have a habit of wanting to have nice content, you know? Because before, my mic would pick up, like every noise if I touch the desk or hit the keyboard or something you know it's just like I put money into it like when I had my PVR like when I first got my PVR that was what two hundred dollars and then I got in I upgraded eventually after a few years through like multiple things and it was just like I I had the shit but I was never doing anything with it until I really started YouTube this year and like I continually put money in but it's, it's not like I'm ever going to get it back, you know? And it's just like, at the rate I'm growing, you know, it may possibly get to that point where I can get, you know, the investment back. But it's not even about that because chances are, if I got the money back, it would just end up going back in. Like, like I've always said, like, even if I got big on YouTube, it wouldn't even necessarily be for, you know, the, the money or anything. It's like, just, you know, for one, I mean, it would be dope, you know, because that's, that's a big thing. Like, people now say they don't get into it for the money, but, you know, some of them do. Like, me, I don't plan on, you know, I didn't plan on getting fucking 2k subs, first of all. I didn't plan on, you know, like, 1k subs. That shit was all beyond my expectations, because I had done YouTube, you know, a few multiple times before, but didn't really find that thing, you know, that I wanted to do. It was just kind of doing it to do it. But now, like, that I actually have something... You know, and seeing it grow, it, it's kind of cool, but like at the same time, I'm just kind of in this point where it's like, uh, actually, I, I don't know what I'm talking about because I fucking lost my train of thought. So, you know, you wouldn't necessarily understand what I'm talking about, but, you know, I, I just like, oh, okay, yeah, I was talking about the money. Like, yeah, if you can do what you want to do for a living, like, you know, nobody's gonna, like, if I could play video games and make fucking tons of money like nobody is ever gonna complain about that because you're fucking having fun you're playing video games you're making money like it's a win-win situation you're entertaining people but like if I made it big like it wouldn't even be about that like if anything you know I'd want to snag some partnerships you feel me you know cuz like that's that's my thing it's not even like when people are big it's like yeah they're making money but I'm not even tripping about the money I just want sponsorships why cuz I love free shit is it that bad? Like, like, it's not even that. Like, you go to a convention or something, you get free shit. I just like free shit, whether it's shitty or not. But, like, if you got free video, even if I got free video games and stuff, like, I wouldn't have to pay for anything. So, I'd still be able to bring content, whether I was making money or not, as long as I had, you know, a mic and a capture device. It's just things like that. But, you feel me? I'm trying to low-key get that Faku sponsorship, though. Does that have anything to do with gaming? No, but your nigga needs his dose of hentai up in this life, boy. Somebody hook that up. Tweet them. Let them know that I'm interested. And let's get on to this picture book. You feel me? Low-key, your boy's trying to snag a body pillow, too. And here we go again, CJ. Look at it. We got that Shimonetta right up in there. Got the panties on that face. You feel me? Because she kind of wild. Doug, you know what's funny? She got panties on her face. Look at that V down there, right? Is this bitch not wearing panties? Let me see that slit, girl. Tell me what you're talking about. We just switched up the mood real quick. Went from serious shit to, to some perverted shit because, like, she's she's lying lying in her... Why was I going to say laying in her arms? She's lying in her arms. Oxygen? Boy, a plastic bag. Beans, bro. What? What the fuck? I'm lost. Is she in the... Am I tripping? Okay, is she laying in her... I, I read that way too fast. That's not the point, right? I was thinking we were suffocating on some titties. Were we suffocating on some titties? No. And now she's putting on a mask. And now we're putting on... Oh, oh, I'm wearing the panties because I don't have the mask and I need to... This, does that actually work for her, though? Oh, I have my back. Oh, yep. Wait, I quickly removed my panties. Pantyasha? Was that Inuyasha with panties? Like, what the fuck? Dog, she actually took her panties off. That is kind of wild, boys. See, that's, that's the type of shit that happens where you just develop a newfound love for them. Like... 
This bitch just took her panties off and put them on her head. Bruh, she has no panties on. You're not going to tell me that body ain't looking nice. Look at them titties, okay? Look at them curves. Look at that wave. Look at that V. Boy. And then she's got a little bit of clothing on, but it's not covering it. It's like, it is, it, boy, it's just, it's that the crowd reacts appropriately. Bruh. Hello? People are watching this? Low key, I wish I was born into an anime. Obviously, that doesn't really work like that. Like, how do you get fucking born into an anime? But, like, anime was real and shit. Like, that's kind of like, you know, when people get drawn or draw themselves as fucking 2D characters, right? I'll tell you how many motherfuckers that I've seen with, like, mascots and commissions and shit. That shit don't look nothing like you, boy. You wish you looked like that. Like, these females and shit. Everybody don't look like that shit, okay? None of you fuckers look like that. If you looked like that, you you know, you would look like... Oh, some of you just still look like fucking dweebs, you know? But, like, some of you some of you look kind of okay. She could be high, you know? It's potential. She might be bae. You look at her, not even close. Who the fuck are you? You ain't this cute little pink-haired anime girl. I knew it was too fake to be true. You could have had pink highlights. No, you're just a goddamn brunette. Okay, I don't know what I'm talking about. But yeah, we're going to go ahead and end it there. Had a bit of a story time right there. I just realized this was 37 minutes. I was thinking it was like 30. There usually it's 30 minutes. I don't know how long these parts are. Because I was thinking like this one needed to go until 40. But then if this one is 37, that might mean that this part was 17. I don't know. These parts are some long ass parts. I was thinking this part was only 7 minutes. Unless my first two parts were 15 then this one would only be seven. But I never want to have just like a short little video. You know, I'm trying to give you guys the full the full thing. All right, I don't know what I'm talking about. This thing's probably over now. I'm just going to go ahead and skip that now. But with that, it is your boy, Stats. I have been your host. Yes, I have. And I'm out.